Hey everybody, PJ here. Did a little modifying to my tater gun. Put a bigger chamber on the back of it. It was a uh, inch piece that was only about that long. It did pretty well, but I wanted a little bit more air behind it. This looks like crap, just because at Lowe's they don't have just a two inch, two uh, inch pipe reducer out there. Probably could order one, redo it. So I had to use a coupler with a reducer valve thing, or not a valve, but a reducer thing. Uh, not the best way to do it. Uh, <laughs> but I got a little project out here and I'm gonna shoot that thing over there and I'm gonna see just how well this does. And uh, I made me a little push rod for it out of a little uh, piece of fiberglass, one of them little reflector things from the driveway I had that I've never used. I'm gonna get me a little patch and I'm gonna put this in. Uh, this is three quarter inch pipe. And I'm not sure what these come off of, I can't remember. Uh, so I'm just gonna stick it in there just like you would on a muzzle loader. We're gonna push it down, I've got it marked. We're gonna see what this does. I don't have any taters. So I'm gonna try it 60 to 70 PSI. Uh, I don't wanna go much more than that. All right, that's 60. It didn't blow up. <laughs> so, it kind of did on me and Roger yesterday. I didn't let the glue dry. That's why I put the screws in here. That way it reinforce a little bit. I don't like this because it only goes in like half an inch. I'd rather have like the full reducer so it's about an inch. But anyway, we're gonna waste this little projectile up into my field and see what happens. Make sure I'm in frame. Sure. Yeah. That's awesome. That thing, it's eh, almost right from where I'm at to the tree line 100 yards. I don't know if it made it quite into the trees, but it definitely made it to the edge of the field. <laughs> so. And I'd say a good, man, I'd say I was at least 80 foot or better up in the air. If I'd have shot it more level, I know I'd have hit the trees, but I was doing, you know, so it'd go high. But that's going to be fun for putting stuff up in the tops of these trees. <laughs> so, like that one over there. Just anywhere. But anyway, a little more air behind it. The other one worked pretty good. I don't know if it went quite that good. But anyway. That's it. I did this little video really to show Henry. He asked me how it shot. How it shot. And uh, I just wanted to show. Don't know if you could see it real well. Might have heard it come out of there. But. I can promise you. <laughs> it went almost to the tree line over there. Which is right at 100 yards from me. So I'll take that for a little air canyon especially for putting up antenna wires and lines and stuff like that but anyway y'all have a good day ak4 pj